Wendy Oldberg. <laughs> she was no, trying wait. to stop no, the wait. picture. It was obviously Lada. Lada likes hiding in boxes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> it was Lada. <laughs> The guitar case! <laughs> the guitar case is inside the guitar case! Let's see... What are we doing besides wasting time? I don't know! Stalling until we actually have an answer. Wait. What? Uh, her suicide? No, I didn't think so. Uh, I'm trying to think. Is it in the crime photo? The crime photo was in. <laughs> <laughs> the crime photo was in the uh th Maya. Maya was in the. Guitar case. The guy photo was in my. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> the crime photo was in the uh, Maya. 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 Maya ate the crime photo. <laughs> Clearly, because she was so hungry that she just. She learned the power of teleportation <laughs> from at a distance, teleported the crime photo to herself, and ate it. In that case, why wouldn't she just teleport out of the wine cellar? <laughs> oh, she didn't learn self-teleportation. She only learned uh, object teleportation, obviously. In that case, why didn't she teleport, like... An axe or something to her that would help her, like, break out of the, uh, wine cellar. Obviously, she can only teleport, like, objects. <laughs> okay, then why didn't she just teleport, like, something that could have, uh, helped her? Like, what? <laughs> Let's see. See, you could teleport, uh, you could teleport a computer to you, and then you could... Computers are too heavy for her to teleport. <laughs> well, what? What can Maya teleport to her, then? Obviously, she can teleport a pencil and paper. And then write a note, and then teleport it back. Saying help from my uh, location unknown. They already know that information, though. That tells them absolutely nothing new. She can send a letter to the police. Okay, we just need to find this. Maya, who has no last name, <laughs> and has no uh, clue where she is. Uh, no, obviously her last name is Lost. Or Help. Maya, help! <laughs> Maya, help! Location unknown! Hmm, okay, so... Someone named Maya, help. Wait, someone named Maya wants us to help someone named Location Unknown. <laughs> Maya, help lo uh, either no, she's telling, this unknown, unnamed person is telling someone named Maya to help someone named Location hmm. Unknown. Do we know anyone named Maya in this place? Maybe they're talking about that Maya Faye person, they want her to help. Uh, location. No, unknown. it's obviously that doctor that's in Maya. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> no. 
<laughs> I met Maya. Maya is a doctor. <laughs> Yes, I'm sure that there is a doctor somewhere named Maya. <laughs> okay. Anyways, uh What are we doing? I don't know. Your ego was in the Pixar case. Yes. <laughs> Side report would be in the although to be fair I don't know why any of this stuff would be something in the crime somehow I've forgotten what it was that I have presented. Adrian Andrews, did I present her? Don't call her a thing. Or any of the other people you've referred to as things. Um. Th this. Uh. Th th this radio transceiver. Nope. <laughs> what haven't I presented yet? <laughs> The entire hotel! Oh, wait, 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 I just got an idea. What is this? The entire hotel was in the guitar case. <laughs> it was the Steel Samurai costume. This. This is a photograph! Yes, the photograph was in the guitar case. And then Maya gave me the... Photograph, which means that Maya's a witness, which is a bit of an issue right now for reasons that I can't tell you. Why can't you tell the court about this, Maya? Uh, why can't the court tell Maya about things? Uh, because Maya is Maya, and Maya needs to learn that when Maya is Maya, Maya can't know things. Maya is sick. How about that? Is, does that... Oh, that's unfortunate. Remind me to send her some soup. <laughs> you can send it to our law office. Okay, where is this said law office? Uh, right in Co Law Office. Look it up. I don't know her address. I don't have a. Cell send three fo phone. Send actually, maybe how about two each? Send six things of soup. Where? Actually, Maya might want a little bit extra. Okay, send eight things of soup to the right in Co Law Offices. I don't know where that is! 
Okay, just give me eight things of soup at the end of the day, and I'll take them home. Oh, that's way easier. Yes. Okay. Anyways, but what is important here is what is in the picture, Your Honor. In the picture? What it do doesn't you doesn't take mean? a genius to see what I mean. <laughs> Are you calling me stupid? Oh, uh, what am I? What? Uh, what I am proposing <sighs> is not that the... Not that your honor is stupid, but that inside the guitar case is the Nickel Samurai the hero's very young costume. Well, then w I what? will watch what you were saying. No, 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 Judge, you, you are not stupid. Explain! <laughs> Why? Why? Right. Are you Can saying the witness opened surprise. the guitar case to take out a costume? Um, I don't have the money to buy fries, but Edgeworth definitely does. Well, tell Edgeworth to buy me fries. I, I'll consider We're later. Fired. What? From, from. D did you just say that what? I was fired if I don't get you You're fries? From life. Uh, fired from life? You're going to murder me? Oh. Why would I do that? Um. I don't really oh, feel comfortable. I don't feel comfortable being in this courtroom anymore, actually. Well, then you'll be fired! Uh. <sighs> But I need a job, though. I need some life! <laughs> Clearly. But what? what? Okay, what? In defense. What insane point would there be to doing something like that? I don't even remember what that is anymore because now I'm worried about being fired. From life! That insane point would be to wear the costume, of course. Miss Andrews put it on to hide her identity so she could make her escape. Anymore? We, we went over a half an hour, so... I'll need to trim that down. Anyways, hi! Hello! After all, you couldn't let anyone see you leave, could you, Miss Andrews? Uh, I refuse to accept your theory. Do you have anything to support such a preposterous idea? Just outside the door was an investigative... In a photographer who was starving for a big scoop. Oh, and in scream. the end, she managed to get this shot, Correct. Photo. Rise. <laughs> <Order>! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like we wandered into quite another mess, haven't we? <clears throat> Look how messy this mess is. Quite a mess. Nice job, Phoenix. You made a mess. <laughs> well, you know my strategy. Speak first, think later. That's a horrible strategy. Well, it's worked so far. It only worked because it did. That's why. Oh yeah, also I think you'll really like the first case of the next game. You'll see why. Okay. You'll see why. Okay! <laughs> so the real murderer is hiding inside a costume. Was! 
He is. The real murderer is actually in costume right now. It could be anyone who was. One second, Your Honor. The Nickel Samurai's costume would have been Matt, Mr. Matt Ungard's. Why would something of the defendants be in the victim's room? Because of the conference. He was going to dress up as the Nickel Samurai and confess something for Matt on guard. He was going to make him look bad, I'm assuming. Mm hmm. Oh, scary. And inside the guitar case, of all places. Uh, yeah. Hmm, seems a bit baffling, not barfing. <laughs> it looks like it said, seems a bit barfing. Whatever that means. Yes. Right? Yes. What? Your Honor! <laughs> Mr. Wright, the court would like to hear your thoughts. Yes, Meh. I told you, we're on a time limit. What is the Nickel Samurai? We are? Since when? The judge doesn't understand. I think it may have been stolen from Mr. On Guard. <coughs> stolen? But why? Maybe the thief wanted to interfere with the post ceremony stage show. Why? And so, if he didn't have his costume, then- <laughs> What?! Then <laughs> Mr. Ongard would be forced to go naked! What?! <laughs> We're just not going costume. <laughs> Phoenix, what kind of reasoning is that? That's definitely not the right answer. Stop being a stupid. No, Mr. Ongard did not I mean, either take- either that or just not- Bow in costume. Mr. Ongard did, did I know, I mean, did not, not take his costume off costume. during the break period. In that case, the costume we are talking about was a spare one. What? Your Honor, are you awake? Uh, then are you singing that the night of murder? Um... <laughs> Okay then. <laughs> there were two costumes! Wow! Yes, that is what I'm saying. I'm assuming you mean the Nickel Samurai alone, not like all together, but whatever. Your Honor! And how do you explain the costume inside the guitar game? Yes! Objection! Your Honor, you are reminding me of that Yanni Yogi person with the way you seem to fall asleep between every s single um, line you I'm say. Sorry, but Please. I'm sorry, current line is not computing due to data difficulties and transfer of information. It would mean that the victim himself had it planned to bring this spare to the ceremony. Oh, so he planned to be boring. <laughs> Right? Is that what's happening? Is he boring? Who's- It's worth your boring. What? That's the answer. <laughs> You're annoying! Get me Just- right. Just move on with the case, Your Honor. Uh, the victim was- Mr. Cornelia was the tenant of Ica's words. Why would he bring costume spare with him? What would be the reason behind this peculiarness? Uh, so answer, that's please. What he answer, intended. Now. Give us an answer. You will what, be drowned. What are you mumbling to yourself about now? Have you just been rambling all this time without any sense of inner monologue? Huh? No, I just. Your Honor, hello!
Why are you away? <laughs> We're going to end it here. Thanks for watching, Farah. Farah.